Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna drag off from your as BP Sentinel. Gonna now you're gonna get the is attacking. Get is attacking. It's gonna convert that to a boolean, and then you can plug it in. So, if this is true, well, first off, you're gonna need to make a variable here. You're gonna make a variable called health. We're gonna have max health and current. Oops, current health. So our, change these to vectors. Compile. Oh, sorry, not vectors. Change them to floats, and then hit compile. Same color. Uh, now you're going to change both of these to, uh, let's say, 5. Change max health to 5. So, if all of this is true, then we're going to take, or oh, sorry, damage, apply damage, damage actor, self, Sorry. Instead of doing that, you're going to. If this is true, you're going to set health. And our max health will be. Uh, we'll get we'll get current health. So we're going to do current health, float minus. Float. So we'll do sure minus one. Put that into max health. Max health. And. Yeah, we don't need two of these actually. We can just have. Just use a uh, current health for both. So we're just going to set that. Okay. Make that look nice. Then what we're going to do is. Play a sound at location, just to know that we're hitting them. We'll do print string for now, just to see if this works. So, go over here. Smash them. Yep. So, that works. So, instead of printing a string, let's spawn an explosion. So, spawn emitter at location. Location will be get actor location self and x actually won't do explosion because we already have an explosion do sparks and we'll also play sound at location same thing as the death sound will be sparks okay Compile, play. So now, normally, if you didn't add that is attacking boolean at the beginning, what's going on with this guy? Okay, I guess you can outrun his uh his senses. Yeah, so you get behind him anyway. So let's see what happens. Yeah, I missed. <laughs> see what happens. There it is. Starts sparking. And it looks like it. This animation does not go away. So let's change that. Get a template. Now let's. Fire sparks. Let's change the volume to 0.5. Okay. We actually won't have an emitter because that seems to mess with everything. Compile. Okay. So now we need to have his death. So time for another branch. So branch. 
condition will be so uh let's get current health oh jeez come on come on there we go so current health if current health is less than or equal to zero then what we're gonna do is we're gonna play death I'm sorry death and there compile see what happens have to hit him five times so this might take a little bit longer There we go. Uh oh, I forgot to destroy actor. Make sure to do that. So in your mutant, go back to your death and destroy actor. Remember to do that or he'll just stay alive. So actually what I'm gonna do real quick is I'm just gonna change, change this to five. So it happens in one hit. gone. So, there's that part done.